All right, so we're going to do a little bench time with the uh, WOL124. Probably just cut back back and forth on it. What I want to do is see if this will fit inside. I want to see if the 124017 uh, drive shaft will work in this. If it does, pinion might be different, or the spur gear might be different. But if I can get the slip the clutch in there with very little modification, that'd be a good win in my book just to try it out, you know. Even if it's just, uh, you know, if it's, even if it's not better, so, um, so yeah, pretty much, another thing I noticed on the new one, not to switch sidetrack a little bit, um, these were glued in on the my this one um, to the receiver. The new one we just got, they're not glued. So there is a definitely something's changed or maybe they're just moving them quick. Anyway, so back to this. Um, pretty much take these bolts off here. Um, looks like when I have to take this whole case off here. Once I get her all opened up, you don't need to watch all this baloney. I'll be back in a minute. All right, we're back. <clears throat> Holy pain in the butt. Um, you have to take the whole damn thing apart. <laughs> um, that's pretty crazy. My diffs are definitely greased. Um, I don't mind. Don't have any problems at all. Look how smooth that is. Looks like it's uh. Yeah, they put vent holes in it and all that. You, I mean, the front end, you got to take the whole damn thing apart. It's crazy. So, <laughs> Like, I still haven't taken that off because you got to take the bottom two off. I figure I'd get to it in a minute, but I want to come back and show you this. Um, it's looking pretty promising. Spur gear is definitely smaller. But that doesn't mean I can't upsize that. Bearings are in the same places. Tops are the same. Pretty promising. Let me get a little closer. Yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Plenty of grease. <laughs> My diffs are all greased. Um... Yeah, so I gotta take that front end off, but I don't think I need to. I think that's as far as I need to go because I'm not sure if I'm gonna go that way. Um, we'll see you in a minute. Be back. All right, so I got the front end off as well, and this is spur gear for a one two four zero one seven, and they are the same. Um, so or a drive shaft, sorry, center drive. So what I might do, um, might do just to play around is put a bigger pinion on that and use the uh, standard WL or the slipper clutch one. See how it works. Um, I'll be back in a minute if I get to get it installed. All right. So here's the uh, bearings on the one, the aluminum chassis style, not the new version are larger than these so they don't work um, but this, the shaft diameter is the same so in theory I could take the end off swap the bearings and we'd be good to go um, that's in theory of course I may try it may not I think I might just button her up and leave her she as she is she's not broken so why fix why, or yeah she's not broken so why fix her you know um, Pretty cool though. I, I was interested to find that out. So, um, and I might tweak it later. We'll see. We'll see. A little food for thought. Dissection time. 